alaikum and welcome. Today, we are reviewing uh, the Uncharted Maverick. This movie is amazing, right? Now, for years, Avatar, uh, not The Last Avengers, that's the God to say the movie, uh, was my favorite movie of all time. And you know what? Still actually is. <laughs> but this is very close second, right? It's a really, I love this scene. I love this scene. It makes it look like his craft came apart. So how the hell did he land? Did it just explode? Or did he jump out? Anyway, the point is, is that this is an amazing movie. And unlike the first Top Gun, where it's just like, they're going to a special flight school, and whoever's number one gets to teach, so it wasn't really a big prize, right? This has a clear laid out mission, you know? They have bad guys they need to defeat. Um, there's a mission. This is the mission, and they have to do the mission. And so, you know, it's very clear. Now, unlike, unlike the first movie, uh, where you got to know everybody's wingman, right? The only person you get to learn is this woman and this guy, his name is Bob. That's the only two, like the only parent. Other than that, the main story is all about Tom Cruise and uh, Mustache Man over here. I'm not going to give any spoilers, but they're the two main characters, right? And it's a very kind of cut down story you know there's little bs there's romance in it but unlike the other romance so they kind of have to gain the barriers it's kind of pre-existing so they're kind of falling back into it but it has a very clear specific mission and there are some scenes in this which i just love um it's just like there's just so many great scenes in this movie and i, I honestly like yeah this bit I love this scene. It's just so cool. This, this movie has got everything you want. Clear, concise storyline. And I know I'm a writer and I, I make convoluted as hell storyline. I love clear, concise storylines. This is what we need to do. This is what we're doing to achieve that goal. And there you go. Right? And it's got that. It's got all the subplots. All the things get neatly tied into a bow. No remaining. I hate it when they have like an extra random subplot. It's like, we might tease an extra movie. No, this is all complete. This is a complete package, bow on top, perfect movie, right? I don't know. Nostalgia of Avatar, though. I really love the blue aliens. <laughs> this is slightly better. This movie, Chef's Kiss, such a great movie. So that's my review of Top Gun Maverick. Hope you guys like this. Anyway, I'm probably going to get demonetized because I'm not even monetized. I don't even have a thousand subscribers. But thanks for watching. Feel free to subscribe. And remember, don't look outside the windows late at night because sometimes things will be looking in at you.